And just like that, Dragon has been released. Getting the call, the snares are open. 3.40 right on time. Again, we'll slowly start to see Dragon uh, separate a bit from the robotic arm there. It's going to get slowly drawn back, and then Dragon will be able to execute all of those departure burns. This a view right down the barrel of the robotic arm as it slowly retracts away from Dragon. Again, that release coming right on time, 3.40 a.m. Central, 4.40 a.m. Eastern, while the station flew to the south of Australia. The arm continuing to slowly back away. Should start to see the first of several departure burns coming up any moment now. The arm already about one meter away. Two meters in the opening, the capsule coming fully into view there. And so with the arm backed away, the departure burns being armed. And the first departure burn has begun. Excellent. Good job. And thank you. Visiting vehicle officer here in Houston reporting everything looking good. And station Houston on two, departure burn one is complete, departure burn two in approximately one minute. Station copies. So in about 30 seconds, the second departure burn should begin, and you can see Dragon slowly making its way out of the neighborhood of the International Space Station. Again, it's going to execute a series of these departure burns, uh, slowly getting further and further away. It's going to exit what's known as the keep-out sphere and the approach ellipsoid, and those are 
basically imaginary boundaries drawn around the International Space Station, uh, where a lot of rules and coordination with the International Space Station flight control team come into play for any visiting vehicles. And all of this just setting up ultimately for the deorbit burn and the landing of Dragon. And there we see it moving at a slightly higher clip now. The de second departure burn has been executed. Station Houston on 2 for Dragon. All right, departure burn two is complete, and you are go for SSRMS safing, and that's step five in one decimal three two zero. We go for safing at step five. That's a firm. And uh, departure burn three is in about six minutes, and you are go to monitor per step three in one decimal six zero two. In work, step three of So for right now, two departure burns already completed. A third one coming up in just a couple of minutes. Again, that release came right on time at 3.40 a.m. Central Time, 4.40 a.m. Eastern, while the station was flying just to the south of Australia. Continuing to get some external camera views of the SpaceX Dragon as it flies away from the International Space Station. The unmanned cargo craft, which delivered about 6,400 pounds of supplies and cargo to the station back in August, now packed with a little over 3,800 pounds and bound back for planet Earth. Had an on-time release right at 3.40 a.m. Central, 4.40 a.m. Eastern. And so far, so good with all of these departure burns. One more to execute, and then it'll eventually make its way out of the keep-out sphere and the approach ellipsoid. And then all of that will set it up for a deorbit burn in a couple of hours from now, targeted at 8.24 a.m. Central, 9.24 a.m. Eastern. All of that ultimately culminating in a splashdown at 9.14 a.m. Uh, Central, 10.14 a.m. Eastern. And once it splashes down, uh, recovery technicians will pick it up and take it back to California where a lot of that cargo will get offloaded and immediately sent back here to Houston where it then gets delivered to the various scientists around the country and around the world at the various international partners taking part in the research on board the International Space Station. So uh, still a lot of miles left to travel for a lot of this research, but everything kicking off with this journey home with that on-time release today. Now the third departure burn for Dragon has begun. And that burn already completed. And the visiting vehicle officer here in Houston recording everything. Still looking good with Dragon's departure. The view is obviously getting a little bit darker. Two, departure burn three is complete and Dragon is now outside the keep out sphere.